Welcome to Watts 3010, Introduction to Web Development. This course is part of the Certificate in Web Technology and Application Studies at the Seattle University. I'm Becky Peltz. I'm going to walk you through Skills 2 assignment. The Skills 2 assignments take us into responsive design concepts and techniques. Responsive design is all about making your web page content available on any device. The standard approach is mobile first, and we'll look at how that affects coding in the following assignments. Viewport tag, variables in CSS, media queries, tabular data, Flexbox layout, grid layout, Google fonts, CSS uh, target studio sol pseudo selector to create a hamburger navigation component, masonry layout using CSS column, media sharing, audio video hosting, video and map embedding, and fixed layout or fixed positioning. So um, we'll learn some new layout techniques and how to create navigation that is usable on a phone size device. This is in preparation for creating a multi-page responsive website for Project 2 assignment. For this Skills 2 assignment, we'll start by cloning the Skills 2 repo from the SU Web Dev account. So, or sorry, not cloning from there, but forking from there. So we'll fork it into our own account. And once we've got it forked, then we will clone it to our local drive. So it's forked into my account here. And then I'm going to get a copy of that address. And I happen to have the situated in my project's video. So I will um, get clone that. And so now I have the skills too. I will code. Actually, I want to move that into 3010. So let's move that to 3010 and CD 3010. And then we, I'm going to use code to open Visual Studio Code, Watts 3010, skills 2. And once that's open, I can see the list of tutorials here that are part of this assignment. And um, my next steps will be to just work through the readmes that we find in each one of these tutorials for a total of 11 tutorials here.